Hey y'all, it's Krista. Um, so today's pour is uh, for a very special organization. It's a piece that's going to be donated for the for St. Jude, but I'm donating it to the Parma Eagles. It's a local Eagles organization that's around me and all the money that is made from this fundraiser is all going to St. Jude. And you know that makes my heart pump. Um, so I'm using as many colors as I could put together of cancer ribbons that um, wouldn't look like mud. So, um, you know, childhood cancer, um, it's close to my heart and I hope that I I get a lot of money raised for this piece and get it donated to a very good cause. Also, notice my new blinds. They're awesome. They're not brown. So um, we'll get Eric to get us down to the canvas and we'll get started. Okay. So I am using another Blick Premier Museum Profile Canvas. It's a 20 by 20, and it's that nice 2 and 3 8 width. Um, love these canvases, but, you know, they're kind of pricey, and um, buying them on sale is good. So I am using today... Amsterdam liquid or Amsterdam titanium white and I have used I have added deco art Americana decor satin enamel to it you know it's like a tablespoon of this stuff to the eight ounces of this stuff so it's you know just a little bit and I'm using 24k deco art Americana decor metallics in the 24k and I finished up my uh, Kathy Carr Parage Posse uh, Fresh Powder Blue Iridescent Pearl. I still have a stock of what Christina Welch sent me, but it's um, running low as well. And that's going to hurt my feelings. But the alternative to this color, you can mix up sky blue light, Amsterdam sky blue light, and add some golden iridescent pearl fine. And it comes pretty close to this. It just doesn't act the same. So I'm gonna be very sad. And then I have another Christina Welch. Um, this is my mystery purple. And I she told me what it was. I didn't write it down. Um, and I know that she's going to put it in the comments on what it is, but it's also discontinued. But it's a beautiful color, very shimmery, nice little lavender color. Um, but you do know that um, my son's cancer ribbon is purple. So purple is very important to me. I'm using a PBO iridescent red blue it's a gorgeous color and an Amsterdam turquoise blue and the Amsterdam permanent blue violet purple you know I have to add a little bit of Krista's world into this piece because you know cancer is nothing to play around with um, you know, you watch these kids and it's, it's heartbreaking to watch anyone, any child go through this. So, um, okay, before I start crying, we're going to, uh, fill my trusty cup and I've already painted my edges because these deep edge canvases, it's, it just works out better if I do that. Okay. So I'm going to start with my white with the satin enamel in it. And my white has been funky and I just watched a goob come out. I'm going to try to catch it. 
Where did you go? There it is. Catch it when you see it because it will create chaos later. It'll make your paint not move. It'll make a whole bunch of bad things happen. So catching a goob when you see it. I'm at the end of my titanium white and I think there's a little bit of gooby action going on in there. Okay, so then I'm gonna use the Fresh Powder Blue. No goobies in that. It's gorgeous. And then I think I'm gonna use Mystery Purple, Mystery Lavender. I should have looked up what she did, but there were so many comments on that piece that I used that lavender that I'm like, ah, I can't. It's just too much. So she'll comment again and let me know what it is. But it doesn't really matter because it's discontinued anyways. All right, then I'm gonna add my 24K. And then what am I gonna do? I'm gonna lock that in with my funky white. I, I watched another goob go in there, but there's nothing I can do about it now because the density of white, it starts to sink as soon as it goes in there. And that's why locking in your gold keeps it from spreading all crazy. Um, I don't know. It's it's super hard to explain, I guess, but just trust me, locking it in is good. All right, I'm gonna use that iridescent blue violet, or blue red, I'm sorry. And then I'm going to use the permanent blue violet. And then I'm going to do gold again, and then I'm going to hate my life that I'm using that white again because none of my other colors have it uh, it's all the same bottle of mix so I know it's not my mix it's my white oh please be good please be good please be good yeah we're oh oh I'm gonna catch it with my glove I don't want that coming out what a mess this piece is so important to me because I know where it's going and I'd hate to have some goob in there making the paint all weird. All right, and let's play with colors again. Let's go into some Fresh Powder Blue again. And put some of my amazing mystery lavender and I've noticed when you put Paraj Posse's next to Paraj Posse's it makes awesome things happen um, then I'm gonna use the turquoise blue those are going to be my flow extenders here shortly and then we'll do some gold again. Now, because it is at the end of the cup, I'm not going to lock it in because it's just gonna be out here anyways. So it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna end this cup with the iridescent red blue or blue red or I'm not using this. Whatever mess that is, I'm not using it. Okay. It's like chunky. I'm not gonna use that white anymore. It's almost empty, so that's a good thing. I got some, a new 2,500 milliliter jug, bucket, I should call it a bucket because it is a bucket, of titanium white, Amsterdam titanium white from uh, Becky Selman's art studio. And I'm excited to start using it. 
because I was on my last jug of white and it's got a little bit of chunky chunk to it. All right, so we're going to do our golden puddle in the middle. You know, I like my golden puddle. Makes all the awesome things happen. All right, emptying cups. I like that. All right, put that up there. And I'm gonna torch it. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Get that out of the way. All right, we are going to pour this out. The cup is really pretty. Kind of digging that. All right, let's go. I'm gonna start squeezing my cup. I was trying to come out too fast. Sometimes you gotta slow it down. I am way off my center. We're gonna fix that though. Okay, tilt back and oh, totally not a 10 on the dismount. I need to fix that. We are going to make it do that and bring this this way. Okay. I just had to barely touch it, but it looked like it was trying to go out of control. I got it. You remember when you were in school and you have to call out that you have it? All right, I'm gonna make some flow extenders here. Nina makes fun of me for this. She's like, well, you'll just put any color in any corner. Yep, I will. All right, I got my four corners. here so our bags are getting ready to get packed to go to Seattle um, I'm super excited to be able to go to Seattle for my son's wish. Um, we've been waiting for three years to go on this trip. So it's very exciting for him to be able to finally get his wish filled. And he's extremely lucky that his cancer didn't put him in St. Jude. But a very good friend of mine, um, her daughter is at St. Jude and she has leukemia and she's been fighting it uh, for three years. So I know what St. Jude does for these families and I know how amazing their staff is and how well they take care of these kids. Um, it's just, you know, all they want to do is be kids, and some of them 
don't get that opportunity, you know, you live in a hospital. And uh, it breaks my heart, but they try to make it the best experience of having cancer you can possibly have. And that's why this is so close to me. Okay. I may not need that other one, but I'll mix it up anyways, just in case. Because these edges on this canvas, they usually need a little extra paint. I'm watching this canvas develop, and I haven't even given it a torch yet. It's freaking me out because it's so awesome. There's just cells popping out all over the place. Okay. I'm gonna do this. Got a little bit of over here, and put a little bit over there, and do this and this. I'm gonna just empty the cup, cause you know what, why not? It's just flow extender and I like emptying cups. Did you notice I didn't use my mystery purple <laughs> as a flow extender? I have a plan to use it for a, for my next pour as a leftover so I would much rather save that. Okay we're gonna spread this out. I don't have to do much spreading out. That's all right. You know what? Every time I do this and I mix up colors with other colors, I think, man, that'd be a sweet little painting. Maybe I just use my omelet turner and swipe out a painting. You heard it first here, folks. Okay, let's torch this. See what happy little things want to pop up. I mean, look right here. How awesome is that? That's just mixing up colors with my omelet turner. Okay, let's spin this around and see what it wants to do. Not taking it over the edge with the actual piece yet. It's not time. Just spinning it around first, trying to catch it on the edge a little bit. And then I'm going to bring it back because it helps open up the bands when you just let it catch on the edges. See how the bands are opening up? Pretty awesome stuff. We're gonna go down to this corner first. <laughs> if you went any slower, you'd be stopped. Okay, then we're gonna bring that back. I'm just watching stuff pop while I'm stretching it out. It's awesome. All right, let's go down here. But I don't think I wanna get rid of a lot of that purple because it's got some sweet cells popping up. All right, I'm gonna stop it right there. And I'm gonna bring that back. While I'm doing that, I'm gonna turn her around so you can see what I'm doing. Oh, I 
see one of my goobers, but it's about to fall off, so that's good. All right, we're gonna go down to this corner. this way and take it off this final corner wanting it to actually go over because I want to open up those bands. All right, I'm going to bring it this way. And we're going to go this way. Let's reevaluate here. What do I want to do? I'll tell you what I do want to do. There's a goob right there. Oi. And I hate when I see them and my hands are all gross. Because I don't want to drip. stupid white. <sighs> All right, now I'm gonna have to tilt, make that go away. All right, we're coming back this way. Coming in hot, we're coming in hot, we're coming in this way. We're gonna make that tilt off. had it with that white. All right. All right, I'm going to do that because the canvas was dry and it was trying to go over it weird. I'm not a big fan of all this blue over here. Man, I am just all over the place today. what I see too much stuff developing in the blue I'm gonna leave it alone okay let me scrape my ten my corners these ginormous corners okay that one's good I know you're gonna tell me that one's not and I'm a big mess no, nope, I'm good. Just the very, very corner. All right, and then what about this one? Of course, this one. Let me get this cup out of the way. I'm gonna come in this way. And I think I'm going to do this and get this side. 
Okay. All right, get these messy gloves off. My messy pink gloves. All right, I'm gonna torch it. Yeah, there's too much cool stuff going on in here. So I'm like, nah, I'm just gonna leave it. All right, let me come and get you for the close-up. Okay. See the cells that are popping up? That's why I wanted to stop tilting. Coming up the right side. Awesome cells. These cells right up here are awesome. And I'll tell you what, that blue tur or turquoise blue next to that uh, red blue, that PBO red blue, awesome. They just electrified next to each other. This is coming around the top. How cool are those? And then there's that corner that I told you I didn't want to get rid of. I'm like, nah, I'm gonna leave that. And then see what's happening in the blue? That's gonna change. Coming down the left side. And nice lines. This is the bottom. Awesome cells down here. And then let's go check out the middle. There's cells popping out of my lines. How cool is that? Look at this cell right here. Look at it. Look at this one right here. It's awesome. It's like a six layered cell. It's awesome. Okay, y'all. Oh, look, I'm getting lacing in here too. I love that crash posse, y'all. Okay, here she is. Let me zoom back out a little bit. And whoever wins this in the fundraiser, congratulations. And thank you for your donation. And I appreciate y'all hanging out with me. And I'll see y'all soon. Bye, y'all.